Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Faith, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a summer clothing haul. I may have a slight shopping addiction, just a slight online shopping problem. I do one of these clothing hauls every year. So I figured now would be the perfect time. Some of the stuff I got back, like when it was the springtime, it was a little colder. So that's why you're gonna see like some hoodies and some sweatshirts and stuff. But it still does get cold here some days. It's like, even in the summertime, it'll be like 90 degrees one day and the next day it'll be like 60. So you know what, this will work. But yeah, if you guys wanna see what I got, this is gonna be a try on haul. I'm really excited. I love doing these videos and I hope you guys like this. If you guys haven't done so yet, make sure you hit the subscribe button right below me and let's go ahead and get into this video. Okay, so the first place I got something from is Zara and I actually, thrifted this online so it's not technically like I didn't buy it from Zara I got this on Macari for really cheap that's my life hack you guys know me I like to thrift things because it's a lot cheaper and you know what if I can buy more clothes that's what I'm going for I saw Tess Christine had this top and I literally don't. almost died because it was so freaking cute this is what it looks like it's just this tan colored button-up crop top and it's made out of rib material and I just think it's a really cute and simple piece and you can just wear this like with anything next two pieces are from Brandy Melville and I also thrifted these I think I thrifted like over half of this so just to let you guys know I'm sure you guys have seen this it's actually a really popular item it's kind of expensive but I really liked it to layer underneath my t-shirts so it's this cheetah cheetah is this cheetah is this cheetah print I guess it's cheetah it's cheetah or leopard you know what whatever you want to imagine it is and it's just a mock neck ribbed top and it looks really cute like underneath t-shirts for layering or just by itself and it's super comfy and i just i love it like this print i'm obsessed with this print anything that has this print it's mine the next piece i got is also from brandy melville this is white cropped hoodie it's made out of this rib material as well but it's really thick which i really like this is perfect to go with my pants which you guys are going to see i got a few pairs of pants i love hoodies especially white so i was really excited to get this one and it fits perfectly i just i love <laughs> loose hoodies so the next store i got stuff from is princess polly i literally could live off of princess polly i'm not even joking i got three dresses from princess polly these are my babies so the first dress I got is this white floral printed dress and it has little tie straps. I wore this the other day for the first time because it was warm enough. Holy frick, this is like the cutest dress I've ever seen. It kind of singes right here at the waist on this side. And I don't know, I just like, you can adjust the ties, which I really like. And I just think it looks so cute. The next dress I got, I literally, guys, I told you I always buy dresses from them because you just can't get cuter dresses. This this one, I get lots of compliments on every single time I wear it. And it's this green, like loose fitted button up dress. It's really loose fit and it's just so cute. And it looks, it just, it looks amazing guys. The next dress I got is also a green dress. As you guys can see, I really like that color green. Green used to be my favorite color. So maybe it's like making a comeback. This one I thrifted online. And like I said, it's another green floral printed dress. This is more fitted, but it kind of flares out at the waist. And then it also has tie straps. This one looks so cute. It's my new Doc Martens that I got that I'm about to show you guys. So thank you to the person who I bought this from on Macari because they didn't have this on the website, so I had to thrift it. The last piece I got from Princess Polly is a skirt. This is a midi skirt. I literally am obsessed with these midi skirts. This is my first one I've gotten. I'm gonna buy something more. This skirt has these tiny slits on the side and it's high-waisted and it's adorable. I thrifted this as well and I got this in a size zero but it's really, really tight. So I would recommend if you get this skirt to get a size up because it runs really small. Yeah, I just, I'm obsessed with this, like with a t-shirt. I think this is perfect for in the summertime because it's so flowy and. The next thing I got, I, when this trend first started, I swore I was never gonna get one because I thought they were ugly, but now I like them. It's kind of what happens with like everything with me. I hated it first and then it grows on me, but I got a bucket hat. So yeah, did I get it because Tony Van Pilots wears bucket hats now? by Naked Vice, which is like a bag brand, and I... A bag brand? It's like a handbag brand, and it's in Australia, and I really like this hat, so let me know if you guys think it's cute or not. I think it's gonna be really cute in the summertime, and it just has NB for Naked Vice, and it's so cute. This actually took, guys, this hat right here took two months to get to me because I ordered this right before quarantine started, and I guess since it was in Australia, I had to go through, like, customs and stuff, but I finally got it in the mail, and I love it, so I can't wait to wear it. The next thing I got, which I just mentioned, is a new pair of Doc Martens. These babies are the most beautiful thing I have ever laid my eyes on. Even though they give me blisters like no tomorrow. I love them with all my heart. They're the Jardin, I think that's how you say it, Jardin Black Doc Martens. So these zip up on the side, which I actually like because they're a lot easier to put on. And they have like a huge heel on them. And at first I wasn't sure if that was gonna look like huge and it's gonna be too heavy, but guys, literally the most perfect thing in the world. I cannot take these off, like seriously. When Before quarantine started, this was all I was wearing. If you guys were thinking about getting these, I highly recommend them. I didn't have a pair of plain black ones. I had like floral ones and I really wanted black ones, but I wanted something a little different. So I went with these. And guys, I 
the next two pieces I got is actually like a sweat set. So it's like pants and a hoodie. And this is one of the most expensive things I have in this haul. If you guys know me, I, I love keeping up with the Kardashians so, so much. Me and my brother literally watch it every single night. I'm not even joking. And if you guys don't know who Scott Disick is, then I'm sorry. Scott Disick has a clothing line called Talentless. And I've been dying to get some stuff from it. I finally got the money and I was like, you know what? I deserve it. So I got myself a sweat sweat. Sweat, sweat, sweat set, sweat suit set, however you say it. And I am in love. I got these sweatpants, and this is in the colorway Bone. I really wanted like white sweatpants, but I kind of liked this off-white color a lot better. If you guys want to know size reference, I got these in a woman's medium, and they fit perfectly. I don't like my sweatpants too tight or too big, so these are perfect. Holy frick, these are like the best quality sweatpants I've ever purchased in my entire life, which is probably why they're so expensive, but I think they're really cute. Let me show you guys the sweatshirt. So the sweatshirt I got had a stain on it when I got it, and I've been trying to resolve it with the customer service, but they take five gajillion years. And the issue is, is they don't have this one in stock anymore, and I want this one, so I think I got the stain off of it. I'm not sure, but we're gonna find out. This sweatshirt I got in a men's large. I wanted to get a medium, but they were sold out, so. I got a large. But it's okay, because I like my sweatshirts big. So this is what it looks like. This is the Show Me Love print hoodie. It's in the same bone color, but it has these three little hearts right here, and then it has a heart on the sleeve that says, Talentless back. The back, this reminds me of like a Kanye West print hoodie, and that's why I got it because I can't afford Kanye West stuff, but you know. And it just says, Show me the love on the back with a giant heart because you know. Show me the love, guys. I think I got the stain off. I literally didn't think that stain was gonna come off. It was so bad, guys. It was like this orange stain. It was like freaking Cheetos. I do really like this hoodie. I've tried it on and it fits really nicely, and it's the same quality as the pants, and it matches really cute pants. So hopefully I can get the stain out because I wanted this colorway. Okay, the next store I got stuff from is Urban Outfitters. So the first thing I got is a pair of jeans because I needed a new pair of jeans because I only wear like two pairs of jeans and it's really bad and I need to work on it. So I got a pair of Levi jeans. These are the wedgie fit. I have like a bunch of buttons right here, which is kind of annoying when you have to pee, but I'll let it slide. But these fit like a glove. I love these jeans so much. So they're kind of just like, almost like boyfriend jeans, but they fit really good in the butt, which makes your butt look good. So Kim K. Where are you at? I also really like the end of them because they're frayed and it kind of flares out a little bit. But every time I wear these, I get compliments on them. So if you guys, Levi's are the way. Next thing I got is another pair of pants because I have a pants obsession. So these are like their tight fitted knit like plaid print flare pants. They're almost like a legging material and then they flare out at the bottom. No, I really like this print. It matches with white t-shirts really well and I'm excited to wear these. I feel like these are really good pants to wear in the summertime. I don't know, but I like them. The next thing I got from Urban is this oversized Van Halen tee. I also thrifted this on Macari because this shirt is like freaking 40 bucks and I got it on Macari for like $25, so thrift mom right there. This is really cute. This is one of my favorite t-shirts I have. I'm gonna be wearing this all the time in the summer because whenever I wear my bathing suit, I have to have a t-shirt like dress to go over top of it, you know? I get this one because it has some holes in it, but they're not like too extreme. And I just like the print. So this is what the front looks like. And then this is what the back looks like. I am obsessed. This is my favorite t-shirt at the moment. The last thing from Urban Outfitters I got is something that everyone compliments me every single time I wear. So this is a champion sweatshirt and this is a crop sweatshirt. It doesn't have a hood or anything. And it's just kind of like a pullover. And it's more of like a vintage style. I got this in a medium because I wanted it to be a bigger. And I am so it's kind of like this brown teddy bear color. So I kind of feel like a teddy bear when I wear it, but then it has this really cool kind of almost like silk fabric champion and purple. These two colors I wouldn't think would look good together, but it does. The next thing I got is also by Champion, but I got this from the Champion website. They had a sale and I've been dying to get a, this color hoodie for forever. And I finally found one. And guys, this is, I, if you go on my Instagram, I've been wearing this like nonstop. No joke. But it's this blue champion hoodie. I got this in a men's size medium. I kind of wish I would have got a large just because it's a little shorter than I would have wanted, but I still love it. The fabric's amazing. The quality is awesome in this color. Like. The next two pieces of clothing I got are from this brand called Attica. I've never gotten stuff from them before, but it popped up on my Instagram and I bought stuff because that's what happens when ads pop up on my Instagram. I mean, what else would you do? I wasn't sure if the quality was gonna be there, but holy frick, this quality is top notch. So the first thing I got is this t-shirt dress that it just looks like this. It has a car on it and it just looks, you know, like I'm a baddie. I got this because I really wanna wear it with that Brandy Melville mock neck. Quality on this is amazing. Like it's a really thick t-shirt and I wasn't expecting that. Legit better than quality than some of my Urban Outfitter stuff. So 
The next piece I got was on sale, and I know you guys are gonna be like, why the frick did you buy that? It's summertime. I bought this because I'm gonna wear it when it gets cold outside in the wintertime, when I go back to school, guys. That's why. This really big, fluffy sweater, but the bottom. This is the most beautiful print I've ever seen in my entire life. The bottom has these neon blue and navy blue flames, and I just, I just can't with this. I just had to get it. That's just literally me in a sweater, and I love this type of sweater. Only $25 or $30, and it's really, it's like insanely good quality. So go check out Attica because this is amazing. Last two things of this haul that I got are sunglasses because I am a huge sunglass fanatic, and I get new sunglasses every year. First pair I got, I thrifted on Macari. These are key, I'll show sunglasses they're just large white cat eye sunglasses they're literally the cutest thing I have ever seen in my entire life the next pair I got is by this brand called Lispix and I got these on Nordstrom Rack they were only $30 and yeah it came in this bougie case that looks like freaking Black Widow but you know film bougie guys these black like really thin cat eye glasses like look how look how cute they are i just i love them i mean some people don't like this style but i really like the style really cute they're only 30 bucks i copped them those are the sunglasses i bought i love them they're my babies so that's all the clothing i've gotten recently i hope you guys enjoyed this try on haul i really like filming these let me know in the comments below what other videos you would like to what other videos you would like to see and yeah like i said I, I do have a bikini haul coming up so i'm super excited about that if you guys want to see which swimsuits i got for this season I have that coming up probably next week maybe a little later depending on shipping because shipping has been slower lately i hope you guys enjoyed this if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up for me if you haven't done so yet make sure you hit the subscribe button right below me if you're interested in checking out any of my previous videos you can click them right over there and i'll see you guys in the next video peace